We moved into this building in uh, 1992 and we've been slowly building up the production ever since then. We were very young, very inexperienced at the time, uh, but we learned, made, made loads of mistakes along the way. I'm Nolene and I've worked at Ireland's Eye Knitwear since the very beginning, over 27 years ago. I'm very excited about the new move, it's going to be fantastic. This will be my third factory move with Ireland's Eye Knitwear. I joined the design team here at Ireland's Eye about five years ago and it's been very rewarding for me to see the growth that we've had here. Um, the collection has grown, it's become, we've been shipping it all over the world, it's become really popular and so we've outgrown our premises here and we're moving on now to a bigger space which is going to be wonderful in terms of design for us as well to have a, a great space to work from. Well, I suppose you say since the business started in 1988 and then we moved here in 1992 we've been here in that building ever since so we're in our 25th year uh, it's been a long time um, I suppose what's interesting was around the year 2000 when uh, the wisdom out there was that it wasn't possible to make this kind of these kind of garments in Ireland anymore it was too expensive and that nobody cared where anything was made so we moved a lot of the production to the Far East and then those conversations started changing with our customers about six or seven years ago where they started asking where the garments made and they wanted to know they were made here in Ireland and they were willing to pay a little bit more because they understood it cost more to make the garments here. So with that in mind, uh, we started moving production back here. We kept a little bit of production here and there was about 10 people employed. Uh, but since that time, um, our employment has grown to 35 people. As Brendan says, we're absolutely squeezed out of the building. Um, so really after 25 years here now, it's nice to be moving to a new premises next week which will give us like three times more space and I suppose start the next chapter of the business. Uh, so yeah, it's all very exciting. We're here in our new factory at Ireland's Eye, which we moved into 10 months ago on the first weekend in March. Uh, we ceased production in the old factory on a Friday evening, and by Sunday evening we were back up in production here. Um, since we've moved, um, I'm happy to say business has grown. We've created an additional 10 jobs. We built a passive room, so in the summer we have natural ventilation, and in the winter we re-divert the heat from the machines into the room so we can keep it at 22 degrees constant all year long. We're now in a modern state-of-the-art uh, production facility uh, with plenty of room to expand and so it's onwards and upwards from here to the next phase in the story of Ireland's eye. Would I do it again? I'd love to do it again. Maybe in another five years' time. <laughs> <laughs>